So I'm going to ask you guys a question. Will Scream 6 be better than Scream 5? Or just a better like movie in general? Um, I'm going to be talking about that a little bit. Because I have a feeling... You know, I had a lot of my concerns before uh, this movie was even announced. Or, well, when it was announced... I kind of had a lot of concerns that it was going to be just like Scream 5. Just less, you know, crisp. But now thinking about it, is this going to be a step forward or a step backwards? Now, I definitely think it's going to be a step forward, number one, because there's going to be chase scenes. Um, it looks like there's going to be pretty brutal kills in the movie. Um, So... That's one thing Scream 5 didn't have. Uh, didn't have, you know, the chase scenes. None of that. So, I think that it's going to be... I think it's going to be better than Scream 5. I think it's going to make more than Scream 5. Honestly. Because of the chase scenes. And just the brutal kills. I think. Um, Scream 5 didn't really have as much. You know? They didn't really have that much, you know, creativeness. So... I think the most creative kill probably in this uh, Scream 6 film is probably the shotgun kill, which we never seen that before. We've never seen Ghostface shoot somebody in, in the face with the shotgun. So that's very, very creative. Um, so I just think that Scream 6, I have a feeling I'm going to like Scream 6 a little bit more than Scream 5 because Scream 5, man, like... Do I, I don't like necessarily like hate it. It's just that I don't know. It's just less like it's not as good because it doesn't have chase scenes, you know, and like the other four films. So I don't really know. Like Scream 5 was OK, I guess. I didn't really necessarily hate it, but it is my last favorite for a lot of reasons, obviously, because the characters does have bad dialogue. Um. Dewey's death, just the way he died, you know, was, you know, lame. Um, no chase scenes at all. There's no creativeness. You know, it was just the same old, you know, screen product that we got, you know, from the last four films. But, but less Chris, with no, you know, with no chase scenes. So, that's just my, um, that's just my, you know, problem. You know, with Scream 5 personally. But I definitely think, it's, you know, Scream 6 is going to be a step forward. Um, I definitely think so. I think um, chase scenes and all that, the brutal kills, just the setting itself, the New York setting, should be very fun, you know, to watch. Obviously, it should be really, really fun. You know, a new setting, you know, we're not Woodsboro no more. So... Should be very, very, like, very much better. I think it should be better than Scream 5. Um, and I think the poster, I like the poster more than Scream 5's poster, personally. Um, so, I definitely think it's going to be a step forward. Like, I don't think they're going to step any, I don't think they're going to step back. Now, the only way they're going to step back is if they kill, like, Kirby, like, in the beginning, in the opening scene. Or something like that, which... Very unlikely that's going to happen because we already seen that photo of Jenner Ortega. Um, or not Jenner Ortega, excuse me. Um, Samara Weaving in the, you know, alleyway. So a lot of people are speculating. Is that going to be the opening scene? Is that going to be in the middle of the movie? A lot of people just don't know, but... See, and that that's why I think, you know, that's going to be the opening scene. That's why I don't think Kirby is going to die, like, early in the movie like that or in the opening. Because I think Samara dies in the opening. But now, a lot of people do see her dying later in the film, which I guess I wouldn't be that mad about it, I guess. But like I said, just don't bring her back and just kill her in my eyes. I just think she should survive this film personally. Um, because he just brought her back, and I don't really see the point of killing her, but 
I think that this movie's definitely going to be a step forward. You know, unless they do some shady stuff like kill Gale. Something like that in some lame way. Like they did Dewey. <laughs> or make, you know, Gale, Kirby, the killers or something like that, you know. That's the only way this movie's going to be a step backwards. You know, but I don't, that's not going to happen. I don't, that's very unlikely. I don't think that's going to happen at all. They're not going to make Gale or Kirby a killer. You know what I mean? I just don't see it, but um, I'm just make. I'm just saying like, if that were the case though, it would be a step backwards. A lot of people would, you know, probably hate it more than Scream 5, to be honest. But I think it's going to be a step forward personally. I definitely think it's going to be better than Scream 5. Um... Just the New York setting and all that should be pretty epic. Um, just the trailer. Really well done. Like I said, this, the creativeness. That shotgun kill was very creative. So, if I had to put my money on it, I think Screen 5 is going to be um, a step forward. Um, that's just my opinion. I think it's going to make more, obviously, than Screen 5. It's going to make a lot more than Screen 5 probably because of the chase scenes as i said in the setting so anyways guys comment down below what do you guys think do you guys think this movie's gonna be a step forward step backwards um because i know a lot of people didn't like screen five including me i didn't like screen five um as much but i want to hear from you guys in the comments do you guys think screen six is gonna be better you guys think it's going to be worse? Or do you guys kind of think that it's kind of in between? Like, that it's it's going to be okay film, like, in between, like, kind of like Screen 5. Like, an okay film. Um, Or do you guys think it's going to be just a terrible film? Like, worse than Screen 5. I want to hear from you guys in the comments.